Hello viewers. Today in this video we will study the structure of human ear. If you like this video then please do subscribe this channel. So let us start to study the human ear. We will study human ear with the help of this model. This is the model of human ear. This human ear is divisible in three parts. From this point up to this point, it is external ear. This chamber is middle ear and the structure kept inside this bone, it is internal ear. So let us start with external ear. The outermost part of this external ear, it is pinna. This is pinna. This structure is made up of cartilage. But the lower part of this pinna, ear lobe, it is not having cartilage. The specific shape of this pinna is designed to receive sound waves coming from different direction. And this pinna directs all these sound waves into this passage. This passage is auditory canal, external auditory canal. The inner layer of this auditory canal, it is lined with some specific epithelium which secrete muca, which secrete wax. So wax layer is deposited on the surface to protect it from infection. Now you can see in the last, this is ear drum. This is structure, blue colored structure, this is ear drum. So sound waves coming from pinna, they passes through auditory canal and these sound waves strike the ear drum. So when this ear drum receives sound waves, then this ear drum vibrates. These ear drum, just see the back side of ear drum. Here this is middle ear and this middle ear has three bones. Bone number one, bone number two and bone number three. This first bone is malleus. This bone is malleus. Just behind this bone it is incus and this bone, this particular bone, this one. This is stapes. This stapes is the smallest bone of the body. This chamber is middle ear. One tube passes through this middle ear and it enters the pharynx. This tube is called eustachian tube. So actually this eardrum is very delicate structure. So pressure of air on both sides of eardrum should be maintained same. So this eustachian tube from the pharynx, it just uh, maintains the pressure of air on this side, equal to the pressure of air on that side. Now I am just removing this bone to show you the structure of internal ear. Now here this structure is uh, more clear this middle ear you can see all the three bones of middle ear this is malleus this is incus and this is stapes all these three bones are called auditory ossicles you can see that uh, the third bone stapes is in contact with internal ear this structure is internal ear this is internal ear. I am just uh, removing it to show you more clearly. This internal ear, this one internal ear, here you can see. It is uh, having these three semicircular canal, semicircular canal, semicircular canal, semicircular canal. These semicircular canals, they are filled with a fluid. So whenever there is change in the posture of your head, 
then fluid inside the semicircular canal its level also changes and this information of change is transferred through this nerve auditory nerve to your brain and your brain understands the position of your body uh, whether it is a uh, balanced or unbalanced so these three semicircular canals actually they give uh, us information about body balance so we balance our body with the help of these semicircular canals of our internal ear then one structure you can see this spirally coiled structure conch shell like structure this is cochlea this structure is responsible for hearing actually in this bony cochlea a membranous cochlea is present and on the inner membrane of membranous cochlea one very sensitive organ is kept here inside this which is called organ of corti and that organ of corti is responsible to receive the information of hearing and that information of sound then transferred through this auditory nerve to your brain and when these signals reaches your brain through the auditory nerve then your brain understand about the sound now i am keeping here the internal ear in its original place here this one so in this way our ear are the organ of not only hearing ear is also the organ of body balance thank you very much